is Friday night. It's currently 424 and we're getting ready for a first date. I've been on a first date in a minute, so I figured it would be fun to get ready together and you guys can help me pick an outfit because I don't know what to wear. It's also like kind of raining outside. I haven't made one of these videos in a long time. I used to make them and I figured we would bring it back as I am dipping my toes into the dating scene very slowly. Yeah, let's get ready together to go on a first date. Okay, I'm gonna curl my hair first and then come back and we'll do a chit chat, get ready with me while I do my makeup. Curling my hair is not that exciting. So I will see you guys in a minute once my hair is curled and then we can actually do our makeup together. If you guys are going on a date too and watching this, let me know in the comments down below if like we're getting ready together. That would be so fun and exciting. <laughs> We'll end up touching it up a little bit later on, but let's start on the makeup because that's going to take forever. And I'm just going to do like my everyday makeup routine because I don't really know what else to do. I always start with this like sea salt spray. It's called hypochlorous acid and it's supposed to help clear your skin because it's sea salt. Okay, so like I said earlier, this is my first date in a while, especially now that I've lost like over 100 pounds. This is the first date that I'm going on since all of that happened. So I'm a little bit nervous. I don't really know what to expect. I'm really not putting too much pressure on it and I'm just gonna treat it as like something casual, you know? And it's literally just like getting drinks. So like there's really no pressure on it. We're just gonna have fun with it and hopefully it goes well. And hopefully I'm not super awkward, but I guess we'll find out. Thank God my skin has like finally started to clear up too. So then my normal makeup routine will be Good enough for this i also like literally have no idea what to wear like what people wear on dates now i feel like most people just wear like a cropped shirt and like jeans but i'm not wearing a cropped top like i don't really think i'm gonna do that even if this goes south at least it's good practice for the future and that's kind of like the mindset that i'm going into like i don't want to put pressure on it i just want to have fun it's always good practice other than that my life has been super boring i have so much homework to do this weekend it's not even funny i have a five page paper due Do you want to show them your outfit? Oh shoot, well, I look like a mess. So, she's also going on a date tonight. <laughs> I think your outfit looks cute. Thank you, come on. <laughs> Cleo's hiding now. talk about this bronzer because it's the best it's from merit it's in the shade clay it's their bronze balm i am addicted to this stuff it is the best bronzer i've ever used it just blends out so smoothly so i wanted to mention this because it's an absolute staple and i think it's very fairly priced too and all of their stuff is also vegan and cruelty free just for the record this is not sponsored by them this was sent to me by them like a long time ago and i'm still using it so it's a great product If the angle changed, my camera died, but we're just gonna blend this out.
put my light on my camera. This is the final makeup and hair. Now I'm going to try and get dressed. I don't know what I'm going to wear. Let's try on some options together. All right. Right now I have on these jeans from Abercrombie, but I'm not loving how it's looking right now. So I think I'm going to change jeans. From the back, it looks okay. This is what I was originally planning on wearing, but now that I have it on, I don't like it. Like, I feel like it looks so bad. I don't know what I'm going to wear now because I was really banking on this outfit and it is just not giving what I need it to like at all. So now we're going to start from scratch and now I'm like starting to panic a little bit because I don't know what I'm going to wear. After tearing up my room and my closet and sweating, I decided on this bodysuit. It's from Old Navy. Jeans are from Abercrombie. I'm pretty sure that they're, I'm pretty sure they're like the 90s high rise straight and then boots are from target i don't know if they still sell these or not but these are like the best boots you can literally see cleo's butt <laughs> cleo and then for jacket this is my mom's vintage leather jacket and it is so sick i think it's so cool so this is the full fit and this is the best we can come up with so i don't have a mental breakdown and it's literally like almost six o'clock i want to leave here at like 6 45 ish it's about like a 15 ish minute drive this was such a roller coaster i'm gonna go make a drink okay this is kind of bad lighting but this is the only spot i can find it is what it is all right let's just oh my god it's like dusty oh god i don't know if i can do this guys i like don't even have a shot glass so literally smells like rubbing alcohol um okay hold on i need to get a chaser i see this not going well but we're just gonna do it for the plot i suppose if we're gonna do it once we need to do it on multiple platforms okay first date shot i'm so scared this is tito's this is just like fruit punch i don't know if i can do it to be honest i'm like really scared Okay. It was not as bad as I was expecting it to be. So that's good, I guess. That was definitely not a full shot, but that's okay. Now I'm going to pour like a little bit into this drink and sip on it for like the next 30-ish minutes. So thanks for being here. <laughs> Here's another look at the outfit. I can't tell still if I like it or hate it. The back looks okay, but the front, I don't know. Mm -hmm. 